For the final plenary session of the week, the House of Representatives has scheduled a sectoral debate beginning with the security sector. This is the idea of the lower chamber to address challenges confronting the various sectors of the country with the intent to reach implementable solutions. The order paper for Thursday is made light to accommodate the debate as the representatives of the service chiefs and the inspector general of police are led into the chamber. A constitutional point of order is however raised by the deputy speaker who appears displeased that the security heads did not show up in person. The house has extended invitation to the heads of the security agencies, not for the purposes of uh, investigation, but for dialogue and explanation of the things around that space. I want to pray that we don't break this sacred tradition of our house, lest we be taken for granted. I therefore move that this sectoral engagement be suspended until they come to address us, take our questions, explain certain things to us. Members of the House support his motion. And I mean, those who support of this motion should say aye. Those again, those again should say nay. The eyes have it. Our dear brothers, you are far from the House in an emphatic manner that this house does not encourage, does not accept representation, particularly at this high level engagement. We thank you for coming. Please convey our message to your service chiefs that we understand the tight schedules they have and we are willing to make an adjustment to reschedule this engagement to Tuesday next week Tuesday next week for them to appear in process. Lawmakers are concerned that the service chiefs had honored their invitations for confirmation of their appointments and supplementary budget defense just a few weeks ago and wonder why an invitation to address the country's security situation would be treated with levity. Terry Ikumi, Channels Television News.